Hey guys, if you are an entrepreneur, a developer, a freelancer, someone who's trying to get a bag, trying to make some money online, I want to go in and introduce you guys to this new software called Go High Level. Okay, now this is a way for you guys to start making some income, and this is why I want to go in and start bringing this to this channel. Most of you guys know me, yeah, I know that this is what we do on this channel. We try to figure out ways that we can use the skills that we have as developers, right? And then from there, how we can also maximize our income online so we can become independent. All right, so let me go in and show you guys the website. Okay, so high level is pretty much a one stop shop for helping business go in and take leads and converting them into sales. But again, <laughs> giving you that small little summary doesn't do it justice. Now, what we have right here is a sales funnel, and it's basically showing you guys how throughout the whole sales funnel, most companies have to use multiple applications to go through the sales funnel and to actually convert users. So again, you'll see things like this, like Facebook, you got Google ads, right? So this is like when you're trying to attract new users. From there, you have things like click funnels, right? Uh, Kajabi or, you know, WordPress or lead pages, right? This is where the person goes and lands on a page after they click on an ad. Then from there, once you capture that person's email, then now you have to deal with a third party company, maybe a CRM, uh, like Soho, maybe you're using something like MailChimp, right? Drip or, you know, Clavio, et cetera, right? And then from there, you also have to start using now different services like Stripe for payment. Maybe you might have to set up some Google Analytics uh, to see if you was able to convert, right? So again, there's a lot of steps that you got to go through to actually set like a proper sales funnel for a business. And this is like what most people have been doing over the years. Now, again, GoHighLevel.com has set this up where you have everything in one platform. Now, before we begin going deeper into Go High Level, I want to make sure that you understand why this is important to you. And the way how I'm going to do this is by actually showing you guys a scenario on how you can actually make money with this service and why is it relevant to us developers. So most of you guys here are email developers, content editors, front-end developers, back-end developers, etc. But I'm pretty sure at some point, some of you guys want to come in and say, I want to start making some money. And maybe right now, as we speak, you're applying to jobs and you might not be getting a role yet, but guess what? You have a skill, just people haven't given you the chance, but you could start freelancing instead of just working for somebody full time. And let's say you create an account on Fiverr or Upwork, or even just one of your cousins reaches out to you and says, Hey, you know, anybody that does a website and you say, yeah, I could do that for you. Okay. So in that situation, there's a client has a small business, has an idea of what they want to do. Right. And now they're reaching out for you to build them a website. But guess what? That client doesn't understand that. Guess what? It's more than just setting up a website. You're going to need to have a way to communicate with your customers. You're going to need to set up maybe some Facebook or Google ads. And maybe you need a landing page to capture the emails from your customers, right? Or your leads, right? Maybe you're going to have to set up some text messages, right? Maybe you might need a way for you to have messaging between your customers and that business, right? So you need more than just a website. The first step for someone to build a website or their business is, I just need a website. That's the first thing that they think, but they're not thinking about everything else that comes with it. That's going to help them become successful. If I go in and I have a Fiverr account and I'm doing uh, email developer uh, projects, right? Maybe creating some templates, right? I can go in and say, you know what? Yes, I could build a template for you, right? For $50, $100, right? But I could go also go in and say, I would charge a more premium, maybe $200, maybe $300 to set up this whole process for you. Set up your email campaign, set up your, um, you know, the way you capture your emails, create the landing pages, right? Help you track your, you know, your customers, right? Do that whole process for them. 
and that could easily be, you know, a three hundred to five hundred to a thousand dollars, depending on the business, right? But you can make some money. That's a five hundred dollars extra on top of what you're doing as far as creating the landing page, creating the emails, creating the application, etc. Right. So again, I'm trying to give you guys the uh, the visuals of the scenario. Now we we'll go high level. You actually have access to all of those tools. So again. With this service, it allows us to go in and be able to provide that to a customer, pretty much saying, hey, you're my client. Guess what? I know you're probably going to need all of these things, and you're going to have to go and pay in you know, all of these different services. Guess what? Sign up through me. Sign up to my service, right? My agency. We have a software for this, right? So again, this is the beauty of go high level, it could be white labeled, meaning that you could have your own application. And then from there, tell them, hey, sign up to codingphaseagency.com, uh, right? And then from there, we will go in and handle setting everything up for you. All right. And all you have to pay us is a set amount per month. It could be I don't know, $150, $200, $300, $400, whatever you decide to charge. And I'll give you just a quick example. Uh, this is something that I've had for years. This is like my compounding income affiliate marketing um, <laughs> chart, right? I use this for everything because everything that I do is compounding income, right? So I'll give you an example. Let's say I have a customer that comes in and tells me, hey, Joe, I need you to build me uh, emails, right? And I'm able to go in and convince this individual to sign up to my service that I will handle everything for them. Now, let's take a look at this numbers here. Let's say to build an email template is $100. That's how much I'm charging for that, right? Now, let's say I go in and I say, I'm going to set you up with my service. We're going to set up, you know, email marketing. We're going to set up the uh, text messages. We're going to set up your Facebook messages. We're going to set up, you know, messages for the CRM to keep track of the customers, etc. We're going to handle all of that for you, right? So we're going to start with this at, let's say, $300 for setting this up, right? So now we went from making just $100, just doing a template, to now being able to say, well, now we made $400 from this business. But guess what? To continue using the service that we are integrating for you, right, and setting everything up for you, guess what? You're going to have to pay us, let's say, $199, right? And just to keep it simple, $200 per month. You might say that's a lot of money. For a business, it's not, right? For everything that you're providing for them, once you set it up for them, you're basically charging them $200, okay? Now, I want you guys to look at this, right? So let's say you're only able to sign up maybe three customers per month. And that's not bad. That's not actually like some crazy numbers, right? Three customers. We're talking about now that you're signing these individuals into this, right? You're making $600, right? Just of that, three customers at the price of $200 on a recurring revenue. Every single month, you're going to make $200 from these individuals in their business. And then now this is going to compound because this is a service that you're setting up for a business. So long as they're continuing to have a business, they're going to continue to use your service. This has now become part of their business expense. Okay. So that $200, no matter what, they're always going to pay it because they need your services as long as it's getting them results. Okay. So let's say, for example, someone comes in, you got three people, 200 each, that's $600 each month. Every single month that you sign up three more people, it continues to compound. Okay. First month, 600. Next month, now you're making 1200. Next month, you're making 1800. After that, 2400, 3000, 3600, 4200, 4800, 5400, right? 6000, 6600, 7200. Now, next year, this is where you start off. Every single month, you're making $7,200 from all of your customers that you've had throughout the year. Okay? That's a total of $54,000 that you just added to income 
to whatever it is that you're doing. You could have freelance gigs. You could have this as an agency for yourself. You could be working full-time as a developer for a company. And now you got also $54,000 that's coming in regularly. This is on the low end, all right? Most people that come in and take this serious, you're going to go and try to go for at least 10 customers per month, okay? At least. We're talking about $2,000, $4,000, $6,000, $8,000, $8, and it continues to go. On your first year, you could easily make $180,000, okay? Now, again, this is individuals that's going to take this serious because once you start making some money, you're going to be like, all right, I'm taking this serious. And it's a win-win situation. The customer wanted an email template, wanted a Shopify site, wanted a web application, etc. But now you're also providing them with a solution with a problem that they already had. And again, you could go in and pitch it to them the same way that I'm just telling you right now. You're going to have to need these things anyways. Okay. Again, you're going to need to capture your new leads, right? So for example, creating landing pages, right? Uh, scheduling calls, right? Setting up SMS messaging, right? Being able to communicate with your users or your, you know, your customers to be able to uh, figure out what the issues that they're having, right? And keeping track of their problems through a CRM, right? So again, this is something that no matter what, they're going to need if they're looking to run a, a legit business, all right? So again, Go High Level provides you with all of these things. And on top of that, like a great dashboard that shows you everything from, you know, how much money you're making, how much your customers is making, right, etc. All of that information you have access to. Now, again, let me show you guys this. This is my favorite part of this whole website. And it's just the breakdown of all of the different applications that someone will need to run a legit business. And then now by using Go High Level, they save money on that. Okay, because when you go in and you show this to anybody, they'll say, okay, yeah, it makes sense, right? And again, it's going to make even more sense for us once I tell you a little something now that is going to come up. So again, you got CRM pipeline, unlimited sales funnels, right? Website builder, surveys and forms, email marketing, two-way SMS marketing, booking and appointments, workflow and automations, courses and products, call tracking, reputation management, tracking analytics, right? And the fact that you could great label the mobile app or have your own mobile app, right? Which is going to have your own business logo, your own information. So pretty much you can say, hey man, they don't need to know that under the hood, go high level is the one that's creating the software. You can pretty much sell this as if it was you and your company that owned this, okay? And basically... Technically, you own it because you're paying for the, the service, right? So now you're also providing the service to your customers. So again, it's a lot of things, right? And when you go in and you explain to somebody, hey, you're actually saving about $7,000 per month to run this if you want to run a legit business and you want to scale and you want to grow, okay? When you break that down to that person and you're telling them, hey, man, I'm only going to charge you $300 a month. I'm only going to charge you $400 a month, $500 a month, whatever it is that you decide to charge them, right? The cool thing about this is that you're still paying your $297 per month. So remember, maybe with one customer, you already paid off your $297 per month that you have to pay for Go High Level. And if you go in and get two customers, you're covered. You get what I'm saying? Like, let's say... If, $300 uh, to set it up, right? And then now they signed up. That right there covered the whole month for you. Everything after that is profit, okay? Everything after that is profit. You get access to everything that comes with the starter, which is like tools to capture leads. Like this is great for somebody like myself that I'm just going in and I'm going to use it for my business. Now, if I'm going to go in and I'm going to start setting it up for my digital agency, right? And I want to go in and start signing up other customers under my account and set them up with everything like I showed you guys on how to make profit with this. Guess what? I'm going to go for the 297, right? The 97 per month is like for one person, 
warm business, right? That will work perfectly. But with this, you get unlimited everything, unlimited sub accounts, unlimited contacts and users, pretty much everything on the app, right? For the same price, $297. Now, let me go in and give you guys like the dashboard of how it looks. Now, this is right here is like the dashboard. This is just to give you guys like a glimpse of how it looks and the things that you can do in here. So for example, you can set up the Google My Business Monitor, right? Which connects to their uh, business account on Google. So when they can see their reviews, they can see everything that's happening on Google or let's say Google Maps, they can see everything that's happening in there. You got connecting to Facebook directly. You could have a widget to show a chat on your website. So and let's say, for example, you have customer service, you could connect your customer service to this widget, and then now they could go in and answer the questions directly to uh, their customers, right? You could connect Stripe for accepting payments online. Again, show you guys a little bit of the dashboard. Right now it's blank, uh, but again, you get the picture. You got all of your conversations. You got on reds, your recent conversations, right? Um, things about actions that you could go in and set up. You got different templates that you could also set up for your conversations. You have your calendar. So in here, if let's say, for example, uh, you got a lead from a Google ad and then the person landing on a page and they say, Hey, I want to book a call with, you know, a salesperson by Friday at three o'clock. All of that is going to show up right here on the calendar. Um, so you can see exactly how many appointments we have, how many things are actually happening, right? You can set up the different times, right? Um, again, this is <laughs> pretty much everything that you need. There's a bunch of different services in one platform, guys. Okay, you have all of your contacts, everything that you, you've you gotten from landing pages, right? Uh, from the chat, et cetera. All of that is going to show up here, all your contacts for your users, right? Right? Uh, you have this opportunities tab. You also have your payments, right? So things like invoices, you could have your orders, subscriptions, transactions, the products that you have, your coupons, right? Tax settings, integrations. You can connect to different platforms, right? Then you have your marketing side where you could set up your social planner. So again, you could connect to all of your social media accounts for a business, right? They could see all their information in here. They could save time by scheduling posts, right? This right here is another service that people charge for, right? And they're providing all of that for you. You have the campaigns that you can set up for people. You could come in here as an email developer and set up the templates for them, like have them with custom templates, okay? So again, you can see over here everything, you know, you could have... Uh, again, <laughs> your HTML, CSS, put it in here. You got a preview of the email, how it will actually look. So yes, there's a lot of customization that you can set up for that business. And again, you can still reuse all of your skills as a developer. Okay. Now, again, you got to look at this as, Hey, I'm trying to set up a business. Not only am I doing development, but I'm also setting up the automations and, and pretty much the integration for different applications for this business to run and ha have like a legit business. Again, it's not just for marketers. I want you guys to keep that in mind that sometimes people get scared about when they see things like this. They'll be like, oh my God, this is beyond what I do. I, I All I do is code. Listen, if you just focus on the code and you don't focus on anything else, on building a business or having extra features or providing extra services to, to people, guess what? You're going to be in the same place 10 years from now. I'm just being honest. Like, uh, trust me, I've seen it. The guys that just say, well, I'm, I'm just a front end developer and they never learn how to become a back end developer. Guess what? They're still doing the same thing that they was doing five years ago. Okay. So same thing with this. This is something that could easily, you know, become a full time business for you where you're actually going in, providing your development side of things, and also providing um, the service as far as setting up a, you know, all the automations and everything that the business needs, okay? So again, you have your automations, you have different workflows that you can set up, okay? You have different sites that you can go in and set up, like funnels. Do you need to set up a website for um, a, a company, right? Uh, they could go in and have different templates, 
right you could set up a wordpress website for somebody directly through here you can set up a memberships program for someone you can have a forms so builder the service builder the chat widget right your media right everything is in here so you can go in and, and provide everything that that company needs okay you can look at your information for your reputation you know your different reviews right and you have different reportings that you could get everything from google ads right uh, how much money you spend on google ads or how much the company spend on google ads and then from there they can see how many clicks they actually got how many conversions they actually received so again like this is like a full application for a business where they have a one-stop shop okay everything that they need uh, to get started and to have a successful business and you can be the one setting it up for them okay so again hopefully you guys see the big picture of what gohighlevel.com really is and some of you guys go and try it out right i'm gonna actually go and put a link in the description for you guys so you guys can check it out but i can tell you right now that this is something that right now i'm considering you know heavy to put for my company because trust me i pay for a lot of services guys you know we got shopify right we got uh, click funnels we got uh sam Card, we got teachable for hosting the videos we got so many different things right convert kit for the email marketing like yo this is a like really a time saver and a money saver like i could have everything in one platform and set everything up from here and then not only that connect you know the features of phone like we don't even have that you know in coding face i don't send texts to people you know how much money I'm probably leaving out on the table by not using text, right? Same thing as, um, as many, you know, different businesses that's out there that probably are missing out on this type of, you know, of marketing features that could really help push conversions and keeping track of, you know, every user and, and how people get to convert. Did they get to convert through the phone? Did they get to convert through a uh, book and a call? Did they convert through you know, an email, like this is actually like a very, very legit um, service, guys. And again, like I said, I'm using it for myself right now um, for my business. We're just setting everything up right now. And I said, you know what? Let me go in and, and actually make a video and show you guys how you guys can make some money with this service. So again, guys, I'm going to put a link in the description. Definitely go check it out. Uh, sign up if you decide to try it out. There's a 14 day trial. Um, if you're interested in this, but yeah, man, definitely go check it out. All right. It's your boy, Joe back at it again, codingface.com. Peace.